And good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Music Free Gaming. All the gaming of those other streams, but none of the music. I hope you're having a fabulous, fabulous Thursday. It is a beautiful Thursday here. A little bummed I got to work later tonight, but yeah, you, you, you go with it. Hey, so I'm going to be kicking around in the 1.17 uh, pre-release that just came out yesterday, I guess. Um, and I, I have had a joke in my mind since they announced the goats and I've decided I'm going to make it happen. So let's get into this. So, so here I am, I'm in uh, creative in a, uh, field here in a flower forest, apparently, or not a flower forest, a dark forest. It's a nice place right here, actually. But I th <laughs> thought it would be fun. Or actually, I guess it's it would be fun. It's, it's the question. Oops, you can't see anything because I didn't switch the gameplay. Anyway, so here I am in a uh, field in the dark forest. We're going to try that again. And uh, I, I was... When they introduced the goats, goats have an interesting... Um, feature, I suppose, is that when a goat is within four blocks of another mob, including a player, including creepers, anything except another goat, really, they will try to ram it and knock it up to 16 blocks away from them. And I got to wondering, if a goat were to ram a llama into a bell, would that be a Ramalama Ding Dong? And the joke was so ridiculously stupid that now I have to build it. So, <laughs> so that is what is going to happen today. So let's start uh, with a couple of things. First, I'm going to need some glass. Um, next thing I'm going to, get, going to need are some spawn eggs, for goats, and a llama. Uh, hmm. interesting that oh I guess I only have LLA that makes sense anyway llama spawn egg okay we can get you know trader llamas but we'll go with the regular ones for now um, I'm going to need a bell I would like the llama to be able to ring the bell it may not be able to on its own, so I might have to uh, rig something up so the bell rings. But let's let's start with this. And this is just the stupidest thing ever. I thought the bouncy llama restaurant was bad, but but yeah, no, this is bad. This is worse. Okay, so what we're gonna need is we need our our runway for our llama. Well, or for a goat, because the goat needs to be at least four blocks from whatever it is it's trying to ramp. Also, goats can jump like nothing, man. They can jump like up to ten blocks or something like that, which is insane. So, we're going to do something about that here. Actually, let's get a trap door. I guess it doesn't really matter which trapdoor. We'll get the warped one, because I like the warped blocks. Okay, that'll make it easy to drop in an egg if I need to. All right, so now, so somewhere right about here, if we drop in the goat there, we need to put, to put the llama right over here. So let's continue our runway. And actually, let's get some blue ice Be diamonds that's like blue ice but not okay so we'll grab some blue ice because why not is uh blue ice expensive yes yes it is unless you're in creative and then nobody cares all right so here's now our llama runway right the llama's gonna just slide down here 
Now, what I'd like to do is I, the llama should drop in here, kind of like, uh, no. no, 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 no. See, see, Wolven, creepers don't happen here. <laughs> also, welcome and thank you for those bits. How you doing, man? Yeah, the creepers care. That That's exactly how that works. Okay, Oops, let's do it this way. There. This is just going to make sure that our llama right, isn't going to uh, meander in there. I, I did. I did. I flinched. Okay. I just want to be sure the llama actually, I guess it doesn't make a whole lot of difference. I just want to make sure the llama can't walk that way towards our goat. <laughs> this is going to be fun. Okay. Now, I'm not, I'm not sure if I need to lock, drop this in here, but let's go ahead and get, go ahead and do it anyway. Um, and I want to, let's get some fence. Let's get ourselves some warped fence blocks. Okay. So now this is... I'm going to go ahead and hang this. Let's see. I guess I can come all the way across here. It's all right. Actually, I don't even know if I need the block. I can just hang the... Yeah. All right. <laughs> so this is... This is the idea. Now, will this work? Almost certainly not. But we're going to try it <laughs> and see. So for... Oh, I also need another trap door right here. This is so I can drop my llama in, All right? The llama, I have one there. All right, goat, goat is there. Now the goat, of course, does need a little bit of space. So sitting there where it's like kissing the llama. Okay, maybe it's kissing the wrong end of the llama. Uh, you know, I don't know. Goats are not perhaps the smartest critters on earth. But uh, they do need to be a little bit, ah, there we go, a little bit further away. Also, I don't know if that trap door is going to get in the way, but it might. It might. Now, lo the goats are supposed to be, how tall are they supposed to be? La da 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 da. Height is, is uh, less than a block, 0 0.9 blocks. So they should be able to walk under this trap door. Apparently, okay, so we got to do that. All right. You know what, goat? You've now pushed the llama too far. <laughs> All right. Um that this goat needs to all right the, the okay can you go back the other way that would that would be great please i don't know i don't can i can i lure lo uh goats let's see can i let's see um behavior i can milk them ah holding wheat yes yes Ooh, actually that might be a good point yeah, that might be a very good point. I might have to, uh, oops, hang on, drop back into creative for a minute. I need wheat. Uh, hello, wheat. Oh, wheat, I found you. Okay, cool. All right, let's drop back into survival. And now, hi, do you see me with this wheat? Sure you do. Okay. Now, unfortunately, the llama is still way over there. <laughs> Don't get you started with wheat. Yeah. Okay. Come on back this way. Oh, you just replanted your farm. Fun. All right. Oh, I can't fly when I'm... Uh, in survival, surprisingly enough. 
All right, hang on. I'm going to need some more glass in this. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> All right, let's 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 try this. This is just the stupidest thing ever, but... And your farm isn't small. Yeah. You know what I'm probably going to need is a door. Okay, so... Okay, back this way. Yeah, that way. Thank you. Okay. Close enough. Boom! Okay. <laughs> now the llama and the goat are going to annoy each other. Okay, so the good news is it worked. The bad news is it doesn't ring the bell. So that's sad. Trapdoors. All right, cool. So, oops. Okay, cool. Ah, fun. So what I'm going to have to do is now rig, rig up something here. How's it going there, Glitz? How you doing, man? All right, so I'm going to have to rig up something here to make the bell ring, which is going to be really easy. So grab some redstone. Okay, and I think let's do it with a tripwire because that's probably the least efficient way of doing things. Ah, so you having a good day out there, Glitz? I hope you are. Okay, pull those out of the way. All right, so now what I need to do, actually, let's, uh, so I'm going to pull this. Oh, wait, go. Yeah, come back this way for a minute. Great. You stay over there now. That's right. Yep. You just you just hang out there. I know. You want to go smack the llama around. I don't blame you, but... Okay, so here's the deal. I, I, how do I want to do this? I think... Oh, uh, not too bad. Not too bad at all, actually. All right, so how do I want to deal with this? Uh... All right, now, I think, let's see, if I bring this redstone up here. Ack! Well, that was dumb. Hi, I'm new at Minecraft. I can't click on things. I'm not new at Minecraft. Okay, so, button. So let's, button. Yeah. Okay, so let's get a button. So the way this should work, right, is when the redstone gets powered, it's going to make the bell ring. Okay. And maybe what I want to do is make it ring more, but we'll go with that. All right, so the next thing, let's, let's see how much, I guess it doesn't really matter. I guess not. So let's grab a, I don't know, let's, oh, uh, sure, let's grab a copper block, because why not? <laughs> okay, so grab a copper block, put one there, and we'll just put one right there. Cool. All right, so get ourselves a trip wire hook, drop a little string between them. Cool. And now, if I throw some redstone dust on that. Okay. Cool. So as soon as the uh, llama crosses the string, it'll ring the bell. And this, this joke will be overdone. Okay. Cool. So, let's see. I don't know if I need to be back in survival, but we'll go with it. All right. <laughs> Success! <laughs> I have successfully Ramalama Ding Dong. <sighs> this is just stupid, but. <laughs> Alright, well, that took 10 minutes. I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the stream, but. <laughs> Alright, come here, you silly goat. Alright. Now, let's. Uh... 
And now the ghost's just gonna wander up and say hi. Hmm. All right. Okay. Oh, <laughs> he was gonna charge, and I just locked the door on him. Okay. Well, you know, like you do. Okay. Come here. You go that way. That's right. Okay. Get out of here. All right. Now, let's go and open up the trap door and watch the goat. Oh, I'm in survival. Ha! Huh? Turns out, survival, you can't fly. Come on, llama. All right, in this case, the goat's just going to sort of push him into the bell. I mean, it's okay, right? Sure. <laughs> All right, so let's, let's go ahead and bring the goat back this way. Come on, goat. Yes, yes. Come on. Oh, I, I may have to draw, draw him away from the trapdoors. Okay, come here. That's right. That's right. This way. That's a good goat. Okay. Just lock you in there for a minute. Let's go and push the llama. That's right. I'm going to push you back that way. Stay. Okay. All right. Let's hop up here. Do this again. This is just, that was just pushy. <laughs> he did it once. I, I've got it clipped. I know it happened. All right. Come here, goat. Back up. Okay. All right. This way. Silly goat. Come here. Might have to block off my door there. Come here, goat. That's right. Come on down. Too bad I can't uh, bring llamas like that, but you know what I might have to do? Is I might have to tie the llama up. So he doesn't go quite... Oh! Well, he went and smashed it, but unfortunately, our llama friend was uh, a little bit too close. So, didn't go ring the bell again. Thank you. This is a stupid joke, okay? I'm telling you, there's nothing. Is this joke even funny? No. Am I doing it anyway? Yes. Yes, I am. <laughs> All right. So step one, let's get this. Come here, goat. Hey, goat. All right, I might have to block off that. Come here, goat. goes there that goes there i've obviously placed a block in a weird place but that's fine that's fine okay you just stop right there good goat that's a good goat okay all right so now let's uh i'm gonna just tie this llama come on right there so now the goat should still smash him over there. And, but maybe he won't wander quite as far. I might have to give him more of a runway. On the other hand, I have no idea what that lead is going to do. <laughs> How much that's going to, to go. But we shall see. All right. Apparently, the goat is not cranky enough. Now, from what I was reading on the Minecraft wiki, the goat needs like four blocks of space before it will try to ram something. Okay, because it's it just needs a little run up. <laughs> All right, come here, goat. Okay, what do I have? Uh, that one. Hi, goat. We're going to do this. We're going to come over here. 
All right, now. Go get it. Okay. Yep, there you go. No, no, wait, no. <sighs> this, this goat is not... Uh, not super happy with this. All right, come here. Let's try this again. I want you to be angry with that llama and go smash him into the bell again because that's fun. All right. Okay, yeah. So is the trap door gone? Yes. Unfortunately, the, the goats, this goat has apparently decided to mellow out a bit. He was sort of there, decided not to be there, you know. You know how it goes. Hi, goat. Okay. Let's go do it. Let's let's do it. Okay. Get get angry with the llama and nope. <laughs> okay. Maybe if I block this there. Okay, so here, I'll just block this all up. There. That way the llama is pretty, or the, the goat is pretty sure it can't get out. It might have been better to do it in something other than glass, but it's all right. All right, goat. You do your thing. <laughs> oh, that is just stupid. I like it, though. That was just... That was dumb and stupid, and I love it. All right. The llama is not thrilled here, by the way. The llama's just going to sit here and spit at the goat. And that's the end of my goat. <laughs> All right. I'm going to need another goat. I don't know what he's still spitting at, but... Oh, he knocked his lead off. Interesting. All right, come here. I'm going to tie you up again. Okay, let me get up the, the fence. Please, please. Okay. I know you're you're an angry llama now. But but you you also have a big neck. Okay. All right, sweet. Okay, cool. So now there we go. We've got it. We have our Ram Llama Ding Dong eventually. At least this way, he's not pushing the llama into the bell. He actually have to, has to slam into him to make it work. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I suppose if I wanted to get really crazy, I'd put a llama on both ends. All right, so let's do that. Because I feel like, you know, crazy is fun. All right. Okay. Actually, come here. Don't put that in there like that. All right. Okay, goat, you are there, which is awesome. I mean, you're in the way, but, you know, that's okay. Okay. Oops, that's not redstone. Okay, so he walks over it, and there's... Perfect. All right. Uh, did I just throw my... I feel like I just... I did just throw my tripwire hooks away. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm, I've got what I need, so... Um, oh, I should probably... Okay, so llama goes there. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, cool. I don't, did I get them tied up? I did not. Okay. All right, let's try this. All right. <laughs> well, I've done it wrong. 
Is anybody surprised at that? Um, can I please? I want to open the trap door. Okay, so there we go. Trap door is now open. <laughs> This is just the silliest thing ever. All right, so llama, fence. Okay, cool. And now I'm stuck. I'm I'm stuck between a llama and a goat. Okay. Cool. All right, so now what I have is a double ramalama ding dong. I suppose I could put ice on the. The other side, too. That would be fun. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe I should uh, move the fence. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sure we're fine. <laughs> All right. Do I still have ice? I do. Cool. Again, not that it's going to make a whole lot of difference here, but... You know... It might, I guess. All right. One, two, three, four. So def the goat's definitely got enough run up at that llama. I might have to make this a little bit longer to... Uh... Yeah, I might have to do that. Which is fine. It's creative. I... Let's go. Let's go another couple of blocks this way. All right. Hello, copper. Let's build this over here while my goats and llamas try to figure out what's wrong with their lives. And I don't know that they'll ever figure it out because they are, in fact, goats and llamas. <sighs> you know, it's not like they. Uh, are going to sit down and compare notes and say, you know what? This dude over here is just being really mean. Okay, actually. Right here. Okay. Cool. There. Got plenty of ice now. Let's get the bell in place. All right. Go and block that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just this is just going to make me laugh forever. Okay, cool. So now let's get rid of this stuff. All right. Uh, also, that one. Cool. All right. So now that should. Just go that way. So we'll see if uh, I might have to uh, said move my fence here. Okay. All right. So now let's see. Let's see if I can do this. Um, hi. Um, okay, yeah, goat's done jump. <laughs> All right, well. Ack, get off the goat. Okay, so you, I suppose, can go there, and you can go there. Great. And I can go here. All right. And meanwhile, that goat is just going to be over there. All right. Cool. Well, um, now that we all know where everybody's going to be, we're just going to drop another goat in there. I like how the copper is starting to weather. So there you go. Real life, you can see how long that takes that copper to do its thing. It's not long. Honestly, I kind of expected it to be a little bit longer, but guess not. Okay, cool. 
I was just a, a little bit surprised at how much... Well, that goat just... Just box jumped straight up out of the... Out of my machine here, but... Okay, you know. We'll go with it. Okay. Put the glass back there. I'm just cleaning up after myself. There's no need to, but I'm doing it anyway. All right. Now, I didn't count this out. This is no way is this even, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. No, but it could be. So, fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, that's the middle. Of course, they're, they're now. I may have to move this go, or this uh, this llama may have to go back. You have to go back. Run for it, Marty! All right. All right. So let's see now. I'm now putting myself in danger. All right. So. Let's see. Okay, llama. No, no, llama. Hopefully, I got the right critter. Seriously, Llama, you and I need to go back that way. Go, go, come on. This is just the silliest thing ever. Okay, come on. All right. There. <laughs> we got it, right? We got it. Okay, so let's... Let me get out of here before uh, the goat decides to, you know, ram me or all over the place. Okay, cool. So now, of course, the problem is right now that goat is too close to both llamas. <laughs> okay. We got it. See? He's just going to hang out there for a minute. He'll turn around, get mad, and... Apparently do nothing. But... The lead is enough, right where it is, to keep the llama from walking over the trip wire until he gets smashed by the goat. And that's the important thing. That That is. That is the important thing right there. Okay, so hey, we've got ourselves. What can I? What can we do to improve this? Let's get some, get some redstone lamps. Perhaps that could be. Oh. Okay, he smashed right through the llama, and no. Oh, I forgot to put the string in, or broke the string. <sighs> okay, excuse me, llama, or goat, goat. Can you um? Yeah, great. Thanks. Okay, we're, we're going to have to uh, figure this out here together, okay? Of course, the problem now is that the uh, goat is on the wrong side of the llama. All right, so what I'm going to have to do here... All right, let's grab a sword. And I'm going to have to... Uh, I hate to say it, but I'm going to have to kill a uh, goat here. Come here, goat. All right. Well. Did manage to push him over the... Okay. Sure. All right. Well, that's fine. Maybe he'll stop pushing now. Okay, yep. That's just dumb and stupid, and I love it. All right, so let's let's get out here and maybe a little, little 
decorate this a little bit. So let's come out here. We'll do this in copper because why not? All right, so. Oh, the, the goat walked over it. Oh, you know what I could do, perhaps? Well, as I said, I could put a trap door that keeps the goat from wanting to go over there, but. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, I did block off the side over here, so. Okay, so we'll block that off. Now the goat has no desire, I hope, to come this way. Oh. Of course, I'm doing all of this with regular copper, so this is going to age. Let's... Let's come back here, copper. And let's get the waxed copper. There we go. And let's just replace... A lot of these with the wax copper. Okay. Not all of them. Some of them will will be there. And I and I might have to actually let's get my other copper block here. Okay. Basically, what I'll do is this will just give me a little bit of Here, I'll just come back here like this. And now I can, just every so often, just throw in one of the unwaxed variants. Cool. All right, so. All right, now this goat, unfortunately, has to die. It's not, not ideal for the goat, honestly, but... It's going to be better off for me. So. Okay. Okay, so that can go away. Good news is I don't have to be in uh, survival here. The goat will apparently go nuts while I'm in creative. So good for the goat. <laughs> All right, so we got that. All right, so let's see, what else, how else should I do this? Um, let's see, now hopefully this works right. This goat's just gonna push me. Oh. One, two, three, set. All right, two, three, four, yeah, I think I. Okay, so what I need to do is, I wonder if I can, no. I tried to, uh, okay. There we go. There we go. There, he just has to be far enough that the goat's not going to push him onto the, the stuff. So that's okay. Cool. All right, so let's go ahead and grab ourselves this little bit of, ooh, if I put... All right, if I do it this way. Oh. Hmm. No, it's not going to, I don't think that's gonna work. I want it to work though. No, all right, that just doesn't work at all. Okay, so that's definitely gonna have to go that way. So, that's fine. We'll just slap the redstone lamp there. And when the goat smashes the uh, the like button, there it goes. <laughs> oh, yeah, the llama gets really cranky, but... <laughs> Ooh, it did still push enough, but I guess that's okay. All right, so that's going to go there. Hmm. 
trying to open this, uh, power this block here, but apparently not. Interesting. I'm sorry, I was just watching this llama, right? Trying to spit at the goat. And, uh... Oh, look at that. The uh, lead broke. I wonder if that's because it fired off so fast. It could be, I suppose. Okay. We'll just leash you up again. That's good. All right. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Okay, there it goes. The llama finally caught up with that. <laughs> this is a bad day for this goat. <laughs> okay. So, yes, sure. This is totally a thing. Um, okay. Yeah, yeah. So, I wonder if I were to put... Another. Oh, right, because that's going to block. Um... Let's see. If I put a slab there, can I get the... All right, let's grab a slab. Maybe I'll make it out of... We'll get the wax oxidized copper... Okay, the llamas are spitting at each other. <laughs> what we have our have now is, you know, llama. Well, let's say friendly fire. I don't think they're friendly. I mean that that was not the nose of a friendly llama right there. All right, so. Okay, so what I'm the other thing I'm going to need then is. Let's, um, maybe let's get a dispenser. Let's grab a dispenser here. And, okay, so let's come down right here. Okay. Perfect. That's just peachy. Okay. Is that oh yeah the the llamas are totally into uh spitting at each other which i guess is okay but we'll fill that with goat eggs all right there haha -ha. suppose what I could do here too is come back on on the other side let's see so we've got ourselves a dispenser there for the goat I, could, I suppose I could set one up for the llamas too you know for you know if if and when they die that would you know Okay. Boy, this llama is stubborn. Of course, I think it's attacking... I think it's trying to attack that llama and the goat is just in the way. I could see it, you know. Alright. If I drop that, do the llamas give up now? I think they do. Though, this guy managed to lose his lead. That's interesting. Huh. Okay, that weird, but all right, cool. <laughs> what we have here is just two angry llamas. The, the, this poor goat is just stuck in the middle, man. It's like, oh, get me out of this. I don't want anything to do with this. 
These, these llamas, they're angry. They're spitting at each other. Stop. <laughs> oh, heck, this one's lost its lead, even. I wonder if it's losing its lead because it's getting spit on. That could be. Honestly, I don't know how that works. I think that is how that's working. Is oh, well, maybe not. All right, let's uh, there. Okay, you guys just kind of stop for a while, huh? All right. Can you guys? I don't know how long it takes for a llama to cool off, but <laughs> okay. So. Anyway, I was playing with this, trying to get a little bit of, uh, now, okay, this is going to probably be loud, but let's get a lever. <sighs> this, here's where my, my redstone skills fall really flat. Okay. Cause I think, oh yeah. Yep, that just, the redstone lamp just cuts off the signal. Which, I guess, is a thing. Alright, so, let's grab, I don't know, I'm going to do some glass here. I don't know what I'm doing. And more than I don't know why I'm doing it. I don't know why I'm putting that there. I'm going to just take that down. It was a thought. Probably a bad one. We'll just not worry about it. Okay. Cool. So we've got a little bit of copper aging there on the, on the thing. That's fun. Okay. So let's put a little glass there. Okay, so we got we got stuff going. Now let's see what what would be some good blocks to uh, help pretty this up a little bit. I mean the deep slate copper ore looks really good, but let's let's see let's grab some deep slate and let's do ooh let's grab some chiseled deep deep slate. Now I've built a stupid joke. But I must decorate it so it looks cool. So, I think I can bring this up here. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, that just looks cool. All right. It's got the fun little wither design on it. Okay. So, that's there. This way we can still kind of see in and... I just want to put some, just run the copper all the way across there like that. All right. So let's see now. What's, what would be another good thing here? Again, I would, I like the, of course the tough could be, Ooh, Oh no, 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 no. I can do this. Um, no, what is it? Um, um, um. Oh, the, the geodes, the, the, it starts with an E, I think. There it is. Or it doesn't start with an E, it starts with an A. It's amethyst. Okay, so we'll grab some amethyst and maybe we'll get some budding amethyst too, because, sure. It, it's a thing we can do. Totally. Okay. Okay, we'll just run a little bit of this. Now, what's cool is the budding amethyst will or should actually start growing crystals, which will be fun. All right, so this is going to come this way. We'll run. Uh... Okay, just a little bit of 
amethyst here going. There we go. Now, five, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did I really go that far? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh man, one, two, three, four, five. <sighs> so this actually needs to go here. Well, that's annoying. Okay, well, fine. <laughs> Fine, I'll, I can do it that way. It's okay. Okay, go. You're, uh. Wow. Oops. Okay, see if I can get out of here. That, that llama just, uh, has no chill. Uh, what did I just do? That's what I just did. Okay. I mean, seriously. Also, my goat is dead. <sighs> well, I mean, that's that's a little bit annoying. But, you know, turns out I can craft up a, a lot more. Okay, cool. There we go. And <sighs> that would be really nice if I could keep these llamas, you know, attached and stuff, or if there was a way that I could, I don't know, keep them on, on their respective sides, you know, without getting too crazy. Whoops, well, <laughs> that goat's in the wrong place. I, don't you hate when you get your goat in the wrong place? It's like, you know, here's where I want my goat, and this is not where it is. <sighs> I want the goat in the middle. All right. We are about to have another dead goat. I'm sorry, goat. Okay, well, that worked. Now he's in the right place. Cool. Oh, let's go ahead and... I want to go ahead and, and take some... Put the redstone lamp here. Now, I don't need... Um, I don't need to actually hook this up to the bell. I mean, I could, but... I don't need to. But I'm just going to go ahead and slap the redstone lamp here as well, so... So it'll light up on both sides when, uh, why is that side still lit? Oh, cause I've got the switch on. That's why. Okay. Yeah. You can see the amethyst budding right up there. All right. Well, that's, that's fun. Now I don't want to block this window anymore, so we'll leave that. Let's see, what would be another fun block? Um, I could really take some of the tough. Right, you know, just... Okay, let's just take this stuff out that's underneath the glass, and maybe... Maybe I'll just run the tough here. I don't have to worry about uh, what's happening with the goat because or the llamas because that's all covered with the glass. Hey, Erwin! Welcome, welcome. Hope you're having a fabulous day. Here, testing. <laughs> yep, I'm. I thought it'd be fun. It, I've got. It's just a stupid joke, and it's turned into something now. I have to decorate. I had this, yes, yes. Well, I had a, when I first saw the, the llamas. There we go. <laughs> that's how that's supposed to work. Just <laughs> stupid. I had the joke is, is uh, you know, if you've got the goats and he rams a llama into a bell, is that a ram a llama ding dong? 
And the answer to that question is yes. It absolutely is. It's just... It is ridiculously stupid. And so, I'm enjoying the fact that this, this goat is just constantly ramming these llamas into the bells. And, uh... So I figured I'd decorate it at the same time. Because, you know, why not? Oh, man. It's... This is just stupid. <laughs> oh, it is so stupid, but I love it. Okay. Now, the problem is now, every once in a while, the goat will charge and ends up on the wrong side of a llama. And when he does that, then he just ends up walking over the bell instead of slamming the llama into it. But it's just there and it's stupid. <laughs> but, you know, it, it's okay. We can, we can have some fun with it. I'm doing pretty well. I'm doing all right. I'm going to work a little bit later tonight, but, you know, it's part, part of the job. But otherwise, things are doing all right. Yep, hopefully things are going well with you. Uh, oh, maybe I'll take some polished deep slate. That seems like a thing. Yep, I haven't had a chance to catch your streams much lately. The, the joy of time zones, and they are such as they are. Okay. Yeah, we'll just take some of that polished deep slate. Yeah, no. He's wrong. Okay. Now the problem here is now that that they have to have four blocks between the goat and the llama for the goat to decide it wants to ram it. But uh, it's okay. We'll go with it. All right. I mean, I could drop in and kill the goat again, but you know what? Where is the fun in that, right? In the meantime, the goat's just going to walk back and forth and trigger the bell, I guess. <sighs> okay, so let's see now. What else do I want to do? I don't know. I don't know. Do I... I don't think I want to take out that trap door. I think that's what's keeping this llama from going over there. It's all right. It's okay. Yeah, you know, it's, it's, you can't, you can't, uh, well, the goat needs four blocks in order to, uh, decide to go charging at the, at the llama. All right. You know what? I'm sorry, goat. We're going to have to start this over. Come here. Oh, okay, good. Now he's on the right side. <laughs> See, you got to keep the goat in the middle. Unfortunately, I don't know how to keep him from charging through the llamas and ending up on the other side of them. But, you know, they'll be all right. <sighs> okay, this is just, this is just so stupid. But it's fun and I and I like it, so we'll we'll go with fun. Alright, go ahead and Ooh. I love the sound of the amethyst though. It's all tinkly. Alright, so we'll just uh Yeah. It's not that the, I mean part of the problem is that the goat is smaller than the llama, so I so I've got a couple of places. Like I put this trap door in, which actually I should be moving a couple of things here. Yeah, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, and then six. One, two, three, four, five, and then six. This is an odd numbered thing, I think. One, so... So from the bell, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fifteen, fourteen. Oh, it is odd numbered. 
Bird is even numbered. Okay. No wonder everything's all funky. Huh. Thought I'd counted that out, but I guess not. Yeah, see, the problem with that... Well, I could put a half slab in. <laughs> oh, man. The, the catch is... The goat is... Because the goat is too tall. I wonder if... If he slams into the llama... Okay, so this is an interesting thought. Let's grab a trap door. The trap door might stop him. But I don't know if it'll stop the llama from getting slammed into it. Alright, so let's go ahead and kill the goat for a minute. Alright, I'm going to put a trap door here. That's definitely going to stop the goat. Okay, the goat's going to go and just slam into it. But, I don't know what's going to happen to the llama. Did I just hear a wandering trader? Eh, maybe not. Maybe it's just me imagining things. It happens. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and just take that out. Nope, I'm definitely hearing... Uh, yes, there he is. There's the wandering trader. That, that trader better behave or he could find himself... Uh, playing the llama games here. All right. So now we've got a... Ooh. I wonder if I could push that... See, what I was just... I was actually just wondering is... Would the goat... Ooh. Maybe let's do it this way. Let's put the trap door there. Take that one out. Yeah, maybe that'll work. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yes, yes. No llama drama. Well, it was, it's a, it was like a, a 50s song thing. Was, uh, it was, it was Ramalama Ding Dong was like the, a line from a song somewhere. Okay, so we put that there. Okay, gonna block that off. Okay, so now what's gonna be interesting to see is what happens when the goat hits the llama. Is he gonna smash the goat or smash the llama through the uh, through the trap door? <laughs> I don't know, but we are going to find out. Because eventually this goat's going to get ticked. And he's going to smash that guy in there. Now. I wonder. Okay, let's go ahead and open that up. Actually, I'm going to do... There. And open that up that way. Now. Let's see what I can do here. Hi. How are you? Why don't you get off my redstone for a minute? Yeah, because this is going to be fun. You'll love this. Oh, yeah. You're, you're going to love this. Come here. That's right. That's right. You want to... <laughs> you want to not be there, though. Okay. Okay. There you go. You can do it. You can do it. I guess I don't need those at all. He can hop up there. That's right. Get up top there. Good job. Oh, come on. Come on. You can do it. No, come on. Up. All right. Do I have... I still have hay. Awesome. Come here. I'm going to draw your llamas up with me. This is going to be great. Come here. Come here. That's right. You can, Come on up. You can do it. You can do it. Can't do it. I think his... Let's see. Come here, llamas. Yeah, his, his llamas keep pulling him back down here. So let's see. What I want to do is I want to get, get him up there. I want to see if I can get that guy in the machine. Come on up. 
That's right. That's right. There you go. Come on. These llamas are not helping. Okay, come here. That's right. Come on up. Oh, because Kirsty's already tied to them. Well, they could sing, I guess, but that's not helpful. All right. Okay. There you go. Can you hop up there? There you go. Good job. Good job. Now you are a turn. There you go. Perfect. Good. Now. You're going to go. You've got a date with a goat. <laughs> it's okay, llamas. You can be in there, too. I kind of feel bad now for the uh, the wandering trader, but not really. Okay, I'm gonna take that glass out. <laughs> oh, and he could end up pulling his llamas in there too. But yep, there they are. Oh, <laughs> this is gonna be a bad day for. <laughs> be a bad day for that guy assuming the goat's got enough room now it might be too crowded it might be it might be because they said the goat needs four spaces it needs four blocks in order to uh, have room enough to decide it wants to attack something so I think the wandering trader with his Llamas have definitely caused problems. Okay, yep. Go ahead. Go ahead, goat. You just keep pushing them back and forth. It's okay. It's okay. You got this, goat. I, I've now really complicated the heck out of this, but it's, it's going to be fun. Or not. All right, I might have to kill a llama. I don't want to kill a goat, but... Oh, you know what's really cool? i able to see what's in my inventory. Okay. Okay. Am I... Okay. There it goes. There it goes. Yeah, I'm just going to have to kill off a couple of those llamas. Just to, uh, just to be sure the goat's got enough room there. There we go. Okay. Wonderful. So now, <laughs> now we've got a goat ready to slam things into other things. Now I thought, <laughs> ooh, no. Okay. So the trap doors are definitely going to stop it. Okay. All right. So that's unfortunate. Okay. There we go. Okay. So that's a little bit annoying. So we've got make sure that's blocked. Because I really don't want the... Uh, that's, huh, I want to take this out, but that goat's going to... Because goats jump like nothing, man. Oops. Never mind. So I really don't want the goat... You can see... Uh, yeah, there's a goat over there. I don't know if you can see it hiding amongst the tall grass. It escaped. I had a gap in the glass, and it just jumped up through it and wandered off. It's like, it's like you know... Okay. Okay, that's that's fine. Oh yeah, that's Yep, have fun, Arrow, and thank you for stopping by. And uh as I play with what has gotta be the stupidest machine ever. Okay, so let's uh I suppose I could come down here. I'm just going to put another dispenser in. Oops. That's not a dispenser. There it is. 
Okay. And we'll just fill it with uh, goat spawn eggs as well. Okay. Give it a button too, so. There we go. So, yes, in theory now, there's plenty of room this goat can decide that, you know what? I don't like this, and I'm going to go charge this wandering villager. <sighs> yeah, I don't know what I could slam the llama through. I guess glass, maybe. I'm just going to put that glass block there. And let's let's just see. Because glass is a transparent block. And I know, if, like, if you're on a mine cart, it'll take you through it. But I don't know what's going to happen with the goat. I mean, is he going to... Because the goat's not going to be able to walk through that, apparently. It's just a touch too tall to do that. All right, let's see if I turn on... Oops. Um... Is it? No, that's chunk borders. There it is. Hit boxes. Yeah, it's hit boxes just tall enough, so it's not going to go through the the block. So, okay, okay, that's a thing. We'll, we'll see how this goes. Hmm. Just a sec. Look at this. Can I do something a little nicer with that redstone? Yeah, maybe. Okay, so. Yes, because this this would, honestly, this would be hilarious to have other animals and stuff just walk into it. Walk into this machine and uh, become goat bait. All right, so let's... All right, goat bait. Ooh ha ha! All right, so that's gonna go there. It's gonna go there. Okay, I don't think the goat will jump out. He won't. I think he'll see that as being solid, which is why it works for mob traps, right? Because they'll just wander off. Okay, not seeing a lot of. Other Ah, yeah, okay, the glass did stop him. Darn, okay. Okay. Oops. So that goes there. Huh. All right, well, that's silly. So what, what do I need to do then? Because the, ramming the ramming the llama did not push him through the block. So what I need is a block that can uh, I need a block that can stop the goat. Hmm. I need a block that will stop the goat, but the uh, the llamas will still get knocked into it, All right? That would be, that would be fun. But unfortunately, I said the goat is taller. Now I could do this with a sheep. Llama fits the name, right? But I could cart a lamb and drop sheep in there instead of llamas, right? The sheep could walk through, but the goat would stop. But the pun isn't nearly as much fun if I do it that way, right? I mean, it could be. All right, so we got... Got ourselves some fun llama stuff. Okay. Hmm. I just am not sure. Do you have lots and lots of stairs options, though. Why do I need stairs options? I'm not entirely sure, but... Oh, that's the cobbled. I guess I could use the cobbled. Ah. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and maybe I'll run a little bit of stairs down this way. Okay, now again, this is just the <laughs> Yep. Oh, slammed right into him. Yeah, it's just unfortunately it ends up the goat ends up on the wrong side. So I could do this. Actually, let me come in here. I'm going to go ahead and put that glass block back for a minute. And then let's get in here with um, a sheep. Okay, so we've got a sheep spawn egg. And I'm just going to toss this sheep down. There we go. Now, the sheep absolutely could walk across. But now the poor goat. I think this goat's going to get a little claustrophobic or something. It's like it's sort of crowded in there. Hey, we'll give some... Oh, great. That. Oh, right. I see. Yep. Because that's how it's supposed to work. Got a couple too many goats. Okay, now I've got enough. Okay, now, so in theory... I'm curious now, if he rams the sheep, the sheep should go flying into the bell. But the goat should stop. The catch is, everything is going to get a little bit crazy. Okay, well, I've got two goats. We'll see how this goes. Um, all right, I said I have no idea why I'm. <laughs> how, I have no idea how one might use the Ramalama Ding Dong, but. Uh, it definitely can have some form of of use, I'm sure, right? I'm, I'm sure Ray of Ray's works is just sitting here. It's like, how could I use this? No, honestly, this is more of a uh, mumbo jumbo type build. It's like, how could I use llamas to... Uh, do something kind of silly. Well, this would absolutely be the way to do it. All right. I don't really care about it being... Oops. Come on. Being visible on this side, I suppose. I guess it... I could care. But... Okay. Okay, so that's doing its thing. Fine. Um, you, you sit there and... that Everyone's just going to get crowded in the middle. I guess that's fine, right? Sure. I'll go ahead and take those leads off. I don't know why the llama got upset, but it really did. Okay. Huh. Well, I guess they're all going to live over there now. So. Okay. I'll just bring this across this way. I think I'll do the same thing over here. Not that it has any, uh, any need for anything, but sure. Okay, so. Actually, the other thing that could be interesting would be um, <sighs> Huh. I was just saying, I wonder if I could if 
if I could set up like a lava blade, of course that might kill the goat, but which would be bad. I don't want to kill the goat. The goat is cute. And I don't want it dead. So, yeah. All right. Okay, so that'll come down this way. All right. Again, just for... Just for grins. I don't know why I'm doing this, but I am, so... Okay. Yeah, everything is just so crowded over there. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so that's... I kind of feel bad for these goats. They're they're kind of now stuck. There's nothing they can do. There's no amount of ramming that's going to happen that's going to just say, "Oh yeah, this is this is what I need." Ooh, let's take some deep slate redstone. Yeah, and I'm just going to bring this down this way. Sure. Sure, why not? I, you know. Okay. <laughs> yeah, if, if they can, if they'll push, I said I may have to kill off one goat. On the other hand, if they push like that, maybe the one in the back will get mad and charge in over there. So, yeah. Yeah, I was just kind of hoping that if the, the goat hits him hard enough, it would hit him through the, through the deal there. But hmm, it seems like that's not going to be a thing. Okay. I also don't know if they do that more in survival or if they. But I think their behavior stays the same even if I'm in creative, so. In fact, I think I remember them attacking something while I was, you know, up doing stuff, so. All right. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a gap there, but I do want to bring this redstone. These redstone blocks over. Sure, why not? Because the... Yeah. Ooh, okay, yep. All right, yeah, that definitely stops the goat. And stops anybody else, so... Wow. That's, uh... That's a thing I'd like to have happen a little more, but. Okay, so that's. That's fine. So we've got ourselves a little bit of. Uh... See, look, I can do redstone. That was bad. I, I apologize for that. Sorry, that was stupid. However, speaking of redstone. Let's get... Ooh, that's right. Candles are thing again. Alright. Well... Yeah, unfortunately, so things start getting pushy. I don't know. I don't know. I need... Something is... Would be nice there. So I don't know what, but definitely something. Ooh, is that going to be too... Yeah. It's going to be too low. All right. Okay, let's go and take that out. And let's get... Oh, I can just take the deep slate stairs. Oh. 
Yep, they're they're definitely having some issues in there, but it's all right. I think as the uh, I may just have to kill off a couple of things there. Maybe not the goats. I kind of like the goats. All right. Well, go and take the llama out for a minute. Okay, so that's going to do interesting things, I suppose. Okay. I guess we'll find out as the... Uh... Did I do that right? I did. Okay. It's like, did I do that right? That's a definite maybe. Of the mates you could be. Okay, so we'll just bring that over that way. And I suppose I could actually bring... Ooh, yes, let's get some polished deep slate. I'm going to run this across this way. Come in like that. Ooh, that's got a, that's got a cool vibe to it. I'm... I'm liking that. If I were to throw in some upside down stairs there like this. Ooh. Spicy. Oh, I like that. Okay. In fact, I could even come in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Okay, now we'll see. That goat's going to turn around, and it's, it's going to be fun, right? Sure. Okay, so that goes there. That goes there. Right, so we get a stair coming that way. That way. Ooh, it definitely hits somebody, but not, not hard enough to make them... Cross the threshold into the bell. Okay, so we get under okay, stairs and some deep slate. Okay, cool. So the stairs are going to come under there like that. And then I need the deep slate. Kind of coming under like that. Okay. And that goat's just going to <clears throat> Apparently, sit out there. He needs to die. I'm sorry. You're you're in the wrong place. All right, goats. Ooh, see, that's what I want. The goats smash them into the bell and well, tripwire, but. Yeah, I just don't have a good way of oh, stopping the goat, but letting other things through there. Of course. Hmm. Okay. Definitely don't need that. Yeah, because see that now that sheep. Let's see, I think I can get. Oh, there's a block there. And I think there's a trader there. See, now for sheep, I think this would work. Okay, other than the fact there's a goat in the way. So these guys would ram them across over to there, and it, it would be fun, right? Yeah. Could be interesting. So, actually, it would be fun to, too, is to get a hopper minecart going underneath the... Underneath this thing. Okay. Ooh. that See, that, that poor wandering trader is going to have a bad day. He's just, you know, he's just going to get slapped around by these goats until he's dead. 
It's funny though. I I'm all I'm all about it. Yeah, so all I would need to do then let me clean off some of the top of this. Ah, put some other stuff in there, but Okay. Okay, so let's take some slabs and what what would be a good slab? I think Honestly, it maybe what I'll do is let's take some of the polished deep slate cuz I've already got that down here at ground level. Now, things get a little bit weird here because of the redstone. And I could do something else that might work better, but... Oh, yeah, see, the sheep, it bounced up into the air. I don't know if you saw that. Sheep bounced up and then hit this. Oops. Hit this block right there. Okay, so that's what ca that's what's keeping the sheep from ringing the bell when the goat hits it. <clears throat> Is it just goes up high enough that it think stops. Okay, that's unfortunate, but Okay. And when it does keep the goat from stepping on and anything else from stepping on the on the bell, but I guess that's okay. Right? Sure. Why not? Okay, so let's... Boy, this would be the uh, slowest thing ever. Okay, so... Okay, so let's come back in here. And let's take some, I don't know, let's grab some sea lanterns. Sea lanterns seem reasonable here, right? Okay, now. Actually, put it in the ground so that I can. Okay, wonderful. Oh, let's let's just run some sea lanterns underneath. We'll light it up this way. And basically, what I'm going to end up making is the world's slowest uh, mob farm. But okay, so because if I make this dark, and then mobs could spawn in it and then would maybe walk across here and drop down into the yeah I could take this glass out I mean they'll spawn on this I'll have to I'd have to take all this stuff out but yeah block this off and that would be that would be interesting I guess perhaps maybe <laughs> Oh, yep, definitely killed the killed the sheep. All right, so now the next thing I would need to do down here is... Right, so the, the mine cart would have to stop. Wait. There. So kind of here's what I'm thinking of doing, and this is just stupid. But the uh, run the minecart through here. Put a pull off of these, pull a signal off of this glowstone, or the, this redstone circuit here. I'll take this redstone lamp. And I could pull it from both sides. I guess it doesn't really matter. But. I'm just gonna clear out a side here so there's room for me to walk. Okay. Now. Okay. 
Okay, so now, so here's the idea, is that I would take, yeah, I could take some powered rails, run them across the, the top of the thing here, and let's see, how would this work? Okay, yeah, so there's the redstone. What about, is there somebody standing on the thing? Yeah. Okay. Cool. So there I can, so I can pull the redstone signal off of that thing. Okay, so, and I could pull it off of this side as well. Right? Just right there. Okay. So now let's get some, uh, let's see, powered rail. Okay, now, what I don't know, because I'm just not as familiar with this stuff. Like, like put a hopper minecart on there. Oh, actually, what I should do is get some uh, hoppers. Hopper, hopper. Oh, and almost certainly a chest or two. Oh, yeah, this is great. Okay, so grab a chest or two here as well. So basically, I'm going to be pulling redstone signal down this way off of this circuit, which I hope would work. I think I'll grab some observers to do that. And then, yeah, I can just take this out. Uh, do I have chests, chests, chests? Nope. Okay. Well, grab a chest. Oh, I do have chests. Wonderful. Okay, right. So I can put the chests there. The hoppers. The hoppers are going to come across this way. They'll stick in there like that right that'll go there power rail goes on top no um i don't know i don't know this is just odd i guess doesn't really matter i actually need to take a quick break here to hit the bathroom i'll be back in just a moment <laughs> Okay, I am back. Okay, with all of the the silly fun. Actually, let's open this up so that I can, <clears throat> so that I have room to move around. It's the, the joy of redstone, I suppose. Okay, so let's take these out. I'll get those in a minute, but go ahead and just I'm just going to go ahead and just run this hopper line this way okay so that'll go like that now we'll take the uh, 
take this rail, just run it all the way across here like this. And now let's grab Bridgestones, grab it and Observer. Okay, so the Observer, I want to be looking up at that. Okay, cool. All right, so like that. Cool, and I'm gonna do the same thing here. Take an observer looking up. <clears throat> and then, I guess it's really dumb, but we'll get the that going that way. So now, oh, I should probably put, uh, get a repeater. Okay, because that signal is really short, so. And in fact, yeah, that way. Okay, so we'll let it go that way. And then, uh, okay, you know, like you do. Okay, so that'll go. All right, so something along those lines, right? So then this is gonna go that way. Put a redstone. Oops. Okay. So now if I get a, let's go, toss the string, toss that, to definitely toss the mutton and the seeds, because who needs mutton and seeds, right? I certainly don't. Okay, so let's grab this hopper minecart. So now, All right, so we'll put that there. Now, the other thing I need to do over here is, okay, let's take an observer, going that way, and observer going that way, cool. Again, I'm, I'm being really stupid about, you know, what the redstone looks like. It's like, oh, this could look pretty. It's not going to. Oh, except I need repeaters there. And actually, that what I might need there too would be um, not the a repeater, but a pulse extender. But <clears throat> uh, you know, which would be fine, I guess. Yeah, because that only pushes it down that far down the line. But I wonder, let's take um, redstone block here. Okay, so we'll take this redstone block and I'm just gonna put it right, I don't know, about there. Now this minecart is not going anywhere. Unfortunately, the line gets powered, but nothing happens to it because well, just unfortunately, it has to be up against something, which is annoying. So, okay, let's do it this way. Okay, what if I were to, I don't know, let's grab some, some of the, the nice polished deep slate and... Yeah. Okay, so bring this up this way like that. Okay. That can go away. That can go away. And what I'll do here is instead right, that would no, that wouldn't work. What I was thinking, oh, I could have a, a piston open. Which is fine. It would an open piston would be a, a good thing, but yeah. Okay, so take that off. Ha. Okay, so let's let me let me try this. Let me get some regular rail here. Okay, this is just 
Okay, so that's going to go there. Let's break that up. That's going to go there. Now I could throw a little redstone just to power the center of this thing. And if I were to put a uh, hopper minecart on one end, you know. Okay, how do I get out of here? I guess I go this way. All right. I guess it doesn't really matter which end it goes to. Okay, so now there's nothing living in there. Okay. Well, that goat just disappeared, so... Ah, oh, what do I have spawn egg-wise? Ah, sheep. That's fine. Okay, so... Let's throw a sheep down there. We'll throw a sheep down there. Okay. Did it get all the way over? Okay, definitely came all the way over this way. Well, that's nice. Okay. Uh, my... One of these days I'll have a thing and it'll be great. And things will make sense. And... Okay. So basically, what I'm going to end up with is the, uh, the world's worst uh, mob killer, but and it's horrible on a number of different reasons. But let's go ahead and run. Go ahead and run some tinted glass right along here. Now the nice thing about the tinted glass. As you can see through it, but light doesn't go through it. So this would be dark. Okay. That that makes sense. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just throw tinted glass all through here. Alright. And then Shoot, I don't know. I should replace this all this amethyst. It's nice, but the... Uh, well, who cares about spawn rates? This is not going to be the most, uh, most efficient farm ever. So... Alright, so let's go ahead and get some of this tinted glass coming across here. Okay. All right, we'll just run some tinted glass here. Now, there should be enough room there. If something wants to spawn, it can. All right, you know what? I'm just going to go boring here with the glass. Let's just run this right across here like this. Now, gonna fall through you know like you do okay so that's all gonna come in this way now as I said what I don't have here is any form of anything to spawn in there but also don't have let's just drop in here for a minute and what are my light levels looking like where are they here Light, light. Okay. The, I'm still seeing sky light, so uh, probably coming through here, right? All of this stuff. So let's. let's see, where did I? Where did I break in? Did I break in? I know I broke in here somewhere. Well, I can always break out. Let's see. Uh, 
Hello, goat. Okay, so what I'll do is... Let's just replace all of this... Uh, We'll replace this glass with tinted glass. Okay. Whoa. All right. So what this should do is uh, block a lot of the light. All of it, but definitely a lot of it. So now, all right. Now I think this is this is actually working because the mine cart is going down to both ends. Cool. Now there's not. Did I pull everything out of there? I thought I had some rail go, but maybe it's because I was uncreative and I hit it. It didn't drop that way. Okay, which is fine. That is definitely fine. Okay. Sure. Okay. So, you know, we'll just uh, pop this in here. Now, what I don't know. Okay, so that's going to go in there like that. Come around the other side here for a minute. Okay, that's going there. Let's go ahead. Clean all of that glass out. Okay, cool. So now, if I were to come up in here, let's see. All right, so now what are my light levels at? Um, oh, yeah, now it's dark in here. Cool. So things could... Things could spawn in here. Which is fine. So I think what I'm going to do... Oops, is I am going to go ahead and... Is I'm going to replace the these uh, budding amethysts with... Uh, Regular amethyst. It's kind of too bad. That's pretty, but... Okay, cool. So I think I've got all of that stuff then. I'll put the glass back in. Like so. Okay, so now... So now that works. I still have goats and stuff in there, but... Or a goat in there. Whatever. So now let's just... Let's let's take a... Uh, zombie spawn egg. Because why not? Oh, this is just going to be dumb. Alright. And... I'm just going to go ahead and... Uh, take that out. And let's just toss a couple of... Okay. Okay, so now. Uh. Set. Weather. Come on, weather's clear. Come on. Clear. Alright, so yeah, so we've got some zombies. They're in there. They might occasionally fall down, just very slowly. Okay, hang on a sec. Options, sounds. Hostile creatures, let's turn them way down here too. Okay. So we've got the zo right, these zombies, they're gonna fall down here. It's gonna be great. And then, the goats, 
there's only one. I didn't think I dropped two sheep in there, but maybe I did. Okay, did the minecart stop there? Oh yeah, there it goes. It's just... <laughs> okay, well, you know, it, it does its thing. So now... Again, this is gonna... This is the... This is slow and stupid, but, you know... Okay, so the zombies drop. Of course, nothing else is spawning. And the goat can't do anything because he's trapped. Right, because he needs he needs four blocks. So what, what I've decided here is that a goat-based mob killing machine is not going to be the right way to go. Also, the bell is really loud. Alright, so... <laughs> this is just silly. Okay. Because, yeah, unfortunately... Right, the zombies are all will all end up somewhere. Oh, I'm curious. What if? Oh. Hey, Lee, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're having a fabulous day. This is just the stupidest thing ever. All right. Ah, no problem, man. No problem. Lurking is definitely. Appreciated and also awesome. All right, I might have to kill off some of these just so the goat has a chance. <laughs> okay, so. All right, come on. Well, yeah, the sheep is going away. Goodbye, sheep. And then, uh, here, cut off a couple of these zombies. Come on. There we go. There we go. So that's going to go that way. Now, in theory, this says works fine when there's only a couple of things in there. You get, you get more than a couple of uh, mobs in there. And the goat just doesn't have a chance. Okay. I don't think anything's actually going to spawn in there. Which is not surprising, actually, but... Okay, let's see if I can get this. Oops, well, I hit the goat, too, but... Oops. That was a repeater. I don't know. That was weird. Okay, so the goat hit the zombie. Didn't seem to do any damage to it, but did, in fact, hit it. Well, that was strange. All right, so. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll see. I mean, the goat gets. The idea here is it said the, the goat gets really annoyed, slams into a zombie, and then. Yo. Know, And then would kill it. It was fun. I mean, I started the stream with just a couple of llamas just for grins and giggles. And yep, the it definitely went and slammed into them. I don't know that it does a lot of damage, though. Oh, come on. I'm now at that point in the... Okay, let's see. Game rule. Do weather cycle. False. There we go. There we go. We'll turn off the weather because that's a thing. Okay, so so the zombies are. Yeah, this is a highly inefficient 
mob killing farm. I mean, like seriously, you could not ask for at least a least efficient or less efficient. There we go. That's the word I'm looking for. Less efficient mob killer. There. Well, now there's two more goats. Um, obviously, if you were going to try to do this in uh, survival, you'd have a way of breeding goats and having them walk in there. But anyway, this is just stupid. So <laughs> let's get that grass out of the way. And just because I keep falling into this, let's build this up here just a little bit. Okay. Yeah, see, the, that's the problem. It just gets too crowded. And then there's nothing else to do. Then the goats just aren't going to do anything. Huh, but yeah, that would, that's, I couldn't, um, yeah, if I had a lava blade, it would just be too bright and then all of the, because the, it would shine up through the trap doors and whatever was up there would, wouldn't do anything, but, ah. <sighs> The fact this even actually works at all is actually kind of surprising. Um, but I suppose if I took a dispenser. All right. Okay. On the other hand, yeah, if I took a dispenser and put it here. Okay. I can do the same thing. Put a dispenser there. And let's take a couple of signs. Right? Signs are good. Let's, let's take some signs. We'll grab these ones here. Okay? Because, sure, why not? Signs are, are okay. So, oops, well, that was definitely a thing. All right, now, I think, oh, no, this isn't going to work at all. I was like, oh, I'll just put some lava dispensers there. But the, uh, the problem is, that, oops. Hey, you know what? Y'all are proud of me. Back off, man. Okay. I was watching Ghostbusters the other day. Back off, man. I'm a scientist. That That's definitely on my mind. Okay, so... This is just dumb. So for a, a couple of... A couple of mugs, this might not be bad, but... For more than a... More than that, the goats just don't have enough room. Right? It's... it's Kill this zombie. Okay. Yeah, so... The, the, you know, if the zombie backs off enough... There we go. See, that's how that's supposed to work. Then the goat smacks him around a little bit. Okay. But, yeah, that's... So what I've, we've discovered is that this is really a stupid thing to do. But it's still hilarious anyway. Yep, you just need to breed up a couple of goats, drop them in, and it'll be great. Oh. Of course, in the, the goat attacks the zombie, and the zombie fights back and attacks the goat. Just like the llamas did. You know, but uh, well, I guess I 
Don't go around this. Here we go. All right. I just want to put the get the tuft back in place just so that I can uh, just so that it looks better from the top. Yeah. It, and then what ends up happening is all the stuff gets eventually ends up in the, the chest. Throw that in there too, just to, not that it matters, but. Okay, so what are, so yes, yeah, so the Ramalama Ding Dong mob killing machine is not a good mob killer. It's really not. Though if I dropped a couple of a couple of other goats in there, right? So if I come in here, let's drop some more goats. And what'll happen eventually? Like this goat's got some room, right? So you might eventually decide that. All right, I'm going to uh, go in a turn and attack those zombies. And yeah, right? It'll be wonderful. Come back over here. I got a budding amethyst I need to deal with. They, they look great, but I just want to take that off for now. Okay, so. <sighs> yeah, so. The, what this might work with maybe is chickens or something. But yeah, that just. That's just not thing a thing here. That, I don't know if that's the not really. <laughs> so, I don't know which slider c covers the bells, but I don't think that was it. But yeah, so eventually a goat gets mad, it turns around, attacks the the other mobs that are in there. And you know, very, very slowly, you end up with dead mobs. But, see if we can, hopefully maybe one will do it while we're, while we're watching here, but. No, nah, they're all going to cluster up again, and no, we're not going to do that. That's silly. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> Okay, well, yeah, see, just like that. That's how that works. Okay, now, does it actually work? Yes. Would you ever really want to ever build one of these ever? No. No, that, that is 100% a no. You will never, ever want to build one of these because this is just stupid. But funny anyway. Yeah, because then the zombie attacks the goat. It kills your goats. But still, it's it's funny, and that's what matters, right? Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Uh, oops. Call, jump back to the webcam. That was... That was all sorts of crazy. It really was. But, hey, it was fun. Um, I actually want to thank all of you for joining me today, Wolven for the Bits. Uh, of course, everyone who decided to hang out, watch, lurk, chat, all that fun stuff. Y'all are awesome. Uh, you can, of course, follow me and subscribe over on Patreon. Patreon.com slash Music Free Gaming. And no worries, Lee. Uh, thank you for stopping by. It was just it was just a stupid joke. Right? It's, Yo, know, if you have a, a goat that rams a llama into a bell, is that a rama llama ding dong? It's stupid. And I just decided to go with it. <laughs> but it worked. Oh, man. Any case, um, next stream is going to be Saturday, uh, 7.30 in the morning, Mountain Daylight Time. Um, it's currently 8 p.m. Mountain Daylight Time. So if you need to uh, adjust your sundials, uh, that is definitely there. And uh, I think we're small enough. I'm going to forego the raid tonight. But y'all are awesome and amazing. And thank you so much for being here. And until next time, be excellent to each other. 
This is Music for Gaming signing off.